When you are in government, many important questions go unasked by journalists, as they often avoid tough questions when you hold power. But as elections approach, real and difficult questions start coming your way, and handling them can become a challenge. We'll see something similar in this video. Let's dive straight into the video. If you are new to the channel, don't forget to subscribe as we bring interesting and thought-provoking content. Let's start. Was democracy best served by President Biden stepping down and basically handing you a nomination. You didn't have to go through a primary process. You didn't have to fight off other contenders. I am proud to have earned the support of the vast majority of delegates and to have been elected the Democratic nominee. I am proud to have received the endorsement of leaders around this country from every background and walk of life. That's not really the way our system was intended to work. Look, I've been in this race for 70 days. She wasn't expecting a real question from someone who was ready to hold her accountable. She mentioned being proud of being elected, but in reality, she was appointed. There is a huge difference. I have never been a fan of 60 Minutes, but I have to give Bill Whitaker credit for asking tough, real questions to Kamala. Finally, a journalist is doing his job without bias, and it may inspire others to follow suit. What do you all think about this video? Let me know in the comments. If you enjoyed the video, don't forget to subscribe to the channel thanks for listening and supporting me